Hi, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to make an another large paper flower. This time, I am going to make a chrysanthemum flower. Let's start with materials and tools. I have selected three different colors of cardstock papers. Kitchen sponge. I usually use kitchen sponge instead of paper blossoms craft molding mat. I have found that kitchen sponge gives clear marks than molding mat when I crease on paper. I am going to use toothpick to make a line on paper. But you can use any sharp edge. For example, empty pens also work well. Scissors and pencil. And of course you must need hot glue gun to nest the petals together. I have already drawn the templates to make the flower. Here I have three different size of petals. These templates will be used to make center of the flower. Uh, you can see here all the petals are ready. I cut eight large size petals in light pink color. These are medium size petals and I have 16 medium size petals in same color. I cut small size petals in two different colors. I have 8 petals in each color. These two cuttings can be used to make center of the flower. We will see how to fold these petals. First, you have to draw two lines along the edges of the petal. your petals will be more vertical so you must all up little bit then you will have wide and beautiful flowers you can see here how to glue on each folding <laughs> Thank you. 
same technique to all the petals. Next step we are going to do is folding flower center. You have to roll each fringe using a rod. Then you have to make a round shape like this. around 14 to 15 centimeter diameter as a base to assemble all the petals. Let's start out the length with large size petal. I apply little glue on back side of the petal and stick on the base. Um, next petal I place on opposite side the first one. Then the third one will be in middle of these two petals and likewise I will attach all the petals in equal distance. So it will be more symmetrical and it will be more beautiful. Here we have outer layer of the flower. Now we will move to next arm with medium size petals. I will use uh, medium size petals to assemble second and third layers from outside. If you feel 
think you have enough letters in the round, please move to next round. To the inner layers, I am going to use small size petals. assembling all the petals. As the final step, I will assemble the center part. The beautiful chrysanthemum flower is ready to decorate. The flower is approximately 32 cm diameter. I have one more flower here. I made the flower using the same technique, uh, but here I attach small size petals to the center. The paper flowers can be used to decorate many events like wedding, birthday parties, photo shoot, and bridal shower. You can use it to decorate your home and your baby nursery as well. I hope you guys like my tutorial. In my next video, I will show you how to simply make palm leaves using paper. Bye and thank you very much for watching.